doc's asking questions. I had heart issues not that long ago. Like a, a heart attack? Well, not a full one. The first thing is, you need a full medical. Apparently your age is an issue now. Where's this going? Casey's getting rid of it. Indy, wait. Please, we need to talk about this. No, I don't want to talk to anyone who knew the truth for weeks and didn't say anything. I'm so sorry. But I asked you... you more than once if you knew anything and you said you didn't know. You lied to me, so just let me do this. I could not have handled this worse if I tried. I'm so no, sorry. I should have been honest about what was going on. You're the only person in the whole world I want to be with. <laughs> I can be pretty intimidating when I want to be. Yeah, I know. this now? Tomorrow, I'm starving. We can get something at the diner. Just relax, Bex won't mind. Wait. Hey, I think it's time you two got out of the love shack long enough to do a shop of your own. Like, you can talk, there's nothing in here I can eat. What do you want? Hey, I'm a busy fella. I mean, Ricky's been keeping you busy. Oh. Yeah, okay, see, so you moved out. That means you don't get to comment on my love life. Like, I need your permission anyway. Oi, so. Brax. Come on, we're gonna be late. Yeah, we got heaps of time. Yeah, not if we have to feed you first. All right, all right, hang on. See you later. <laughs> so you sorted the tomorrow situation out, right? Yep. So what was that? What? That strange little dance you two just did around each other. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, mate, I don't believe you. Well, there's not much I can do about that, is there? 